Hello happy people, I'm back with another video and today I'm super excited because as you all can tell from the title of the video, I hopped back onto Eno Couture's site and I got me a super scoop. It's finally here. So I'm going to go ahead and hop right into this to see what all was included in the super scoop. Now I have done quite a few hauls from Eno Couture and there are different uh, sizes of scoops. I've bought four scoops in the past. I bought two scoops. I bought single scoops. This is my first super scoop, but I have everything in a consolidated playlist here on YouTube for you guys. I am going to go ahead and leave that playlist link down in the description box below in case you guys want to see what I got in my previous scoops from Eno Couture. So let's hop on into it. So this here is the size of the super scoop. Let's see how far I can zoom out here so you guys can get a good look see here. Okay, so this is how big the Super Scoop is. I don't even think the whole box fits in the frame. It actually does not. But this is how big it is. It's definitely bigger than the size of the single scoops and how they have been coming. But it's not as big as the box um, was that I got for my original four scoops. It is a little bit smaller than that. Um, but I am excited to see what's all included in here. Okay, so let's hop into it. I do smell monomer right off the bat, you guys, so there is definitely monomer in here. It's interesting that people said they can't smell his monomer through the packaging. I can. It's strong. <laughs> so I might actually, I think it's upside down. So let me, let me flip this over for you guys. I'm kind of it right upside down. Alright, so this is what the box is looking like. It does have a little bit of weight on it, so... Um, I'm excited to see what's in it. I guess it's the large mailing box from USPS. But yeah, y'all, let's pop it open. And let's take a look at the goodies we got. I'm excited. Yeah, that monomer strong. Okay, so this is what we see upon first opening it. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and put the box over to the side. Let's take a little sneak peek here. Ooh, ooh, okay. I, ooh, all right. I see some goodies in here. I'm already excited about. Okay, so I'm gonna put this over to the side, and we'll, I'm gonna just pull everything out as I see it. Okay. As you all saw when I first opened the box, I did get another apron. And I've actually really been liking these aprons. Um, uh, I actually use it when I'm in the nail room doing my nails. I put one down in my kitchen. And then I, um, if you all saw my most recent video that I posted of me packing my um, mobile nail supply kit or my mobile nail tech kit um, that I bring with me, um, I do have one of those in there as well. So these are definitely useful. They're good quality. I really like them a lot. I'm happy to have another one. So exciting. Y'all, I see some really cool stuff in this box. I'm excited about it. Okay. So these are the nail tips that um, are, came in this box. So I noticed that, like, he doesn't do as many nail tips as he used to do with his scoops. I think that's because a lot of people were complaining about it. But funny enough, that's the reason I bought his scoops. I actually really, really enjoy his nail tips. And so that was the main reason I started getting his scoop is because I love full cover nail tips. I'm a Gel X girl. I like applying press-on nails, especially press-ons with different mediums and applications. So that's the reason I got his tips. And I'm excited because this one actually came with, looks like one, two, three, four, five bags of nail tips. I think I've been seeing most people only get four packs, so I'm happy to have five. So let's go through and look at each one. So I got the Princess Pink Almond. Um, if you guys uh, did miss it, I do have a dedicated video that shows all the different shapes, sizes, and lengths, and colors for the tips that are included in these scoops. So I'm also going to leave that video linked down in the description box below in case you guys want a more detailed view of what these look like and how they fit the nail bed. But um, yeah, I got Princess Pink Almond. I got sculptured almond medium so i'm curious to see what his sculptured nails look like i don't actually have any of those so that's pretty exciting let's take a look here i'm gonna put out a size three so the sculpture nail tips are supposed to have more of like an apex on it as opposed to oh yeah oh nice yeah they're definitely a little bit sturdier than his original nail tip but do you guys see how deep that apex is on here or how high the apex is and that's supposed to give it more of a sculpted look you know, you can even see compared to the nail tips I have on. These aren't, um, you know, couture tips, but um, you see that it has more of an apex a application as opposed to it being a little bit on the flatter side. So these are nice. I'm going to have fun playing around with these. And I'm a big fan of 
almond shaped nails and honestly look this is just about the size of the nails that I have on y'all see that oh yeah I love these how cute are these oh my gosh okay very very happy to have these yes lord yeah that's cool yeah I like that a lot okay so sculptured almond that's dope okay and then I got princess pink coffin which is awesome okay I think I mainly had princess pink um, almond, so I'm happy to have more of the coffin shaped ones. I do feel like the coffin shaped tips are a little bit stronger than the almond shaped tips um, based off a couple wear tests that I've recently done, but I'll test that a little bit further. But got that. And then we got some short length. <gasps> oh, you guys, I got the short square. OMG, you guys. Oh, this is exciting. I've been seeing people get the short square length. Oh my gosh. These are the sport lids. So these, this is a short square. How cute are these, you guys? Oh my gosh, I'm excited. Oh, look at that. You guys, look at that. I got a short square. Oh, that's exciting. I literally saw somebody unbox this and I was like, oh, I want one. Oh, I'm so happy I got one. Look at that. So it's a night, oops. Oh, don't, don't, don't leave me now. Oh, that's exciting. Look at that. So that's what the short square length look like. Oh, I love it, you guys. I love it. It's slightly shorter than the ones I have on. So if I so if I decided to clip these down, it would be this exact length. Oh, I love it, y'all. That is so cool. I, I love it. I like that he's including new tips in here. So far, it's two, two types of tips in here I don't even have at all, which is awesome. Okay, so that's that. And then the last pack here is Tapered Coffin. OMG. So let's see what that looks like. I don't have this one either. Wow, you guys. Okay. Okay. Like I said, part of the reason I get these scoops is because I love full cover tips. So I get excited about these. This is cool. Oh, wow. Look at that. Baby, and look at that apex on here. That apex. Pex and ain't it, y'all. I love it nice thin flexible at the cuticle okay nice thick sturdy at the um at the tip yeah these are nice oh but these are long though so what are these are these extra extra long? i think these are extra extra long coffin y'all oh these are pretty though look at that that is so cute i love it y'all see that you see the shape here on the side oh yeah that's nice it has a really nice deep C curve right there. Oh, that's pretty. Okay, y'all. All right. So that is amazing. I love that he's including new types of tips in here because I don't know. I guess people were getting pretty played out on the other nail tips that he had. But I, I personally, I love all the tips that he included, uh, whether they're repeats or not. But yeah, I got one of each. So like I said, I got one, two, three, four, five packs of nails. Next here, I see that I got another file and a cuticle stick. I actually really love these cuticle sticks. I use them all the time, so I got that. Also got a couple of nail stickers, which is really cool. These are pretty. So these are like some black nail stickers with some cool foil on it. And then these here are some, looks like some Valentine's Day. Oh wow, ain't he funny? Y'all see this? It say, made the Max be with you. Oh my gosh, okay Max. <laughs> Oh, uh, but yeah, these are cute little heart stickers. They got the little drip on it. And actually what I'm wearing on my nails right now, you guys, is some Enel Couture stickers. Let me show you. So I actually got this. Oops. So I actually got this pack of stickers in one of my previous scoops. And I actually did do my nails with them. So that is what my nails are looking like with some of my stickers from my most recent, from one of my previous Eno Couture scoops. But yeah, I'm happy to have more of his stickers. They are really good, they're nice. Alrighty, I did get a couple of boxes of foils. So in this particular super scoop, I got one, two, three, four boxes of foils. And this is what they are looking like. I'll give you guys up close. So this is really pretty. This here is a black, uh, white, and lace foil. Um, I don't know if I already have this or not. I'm sure I do, so I have to look through and see. Um, I got these ones here. These are really cute. They some um, really cool hollow um, foils. They got like different shapes like the sun, the heart, little cheetah print situation. My daughter is going to absolutely love these, okay? Um, and next we have here um, some beautiful kind of floral uh, foils. And then we got some more hollow, but this time it's animal print. Oh, this is cute. 
Yeah, I don't have this one, uh, but it has like snake skin, peacock feathers, um, a little bit of leopard print, leopard with rose on it. Oh, that's cute. Look at this one here, y'all. I like this. This is like a leopard print with a rose on it that's hollow in the background. That's really cute. I like that. Okay. Cool. All right. I don't have this one. I know I don't have this box here. So cool to see more variety, you guys. So yeah, I got four boxes of foils. Next here, I see that we got, I'm assuming this is a nail glue. So that's pretty, yeah, it is. It's a nail glue. So that's cool that he included a nail glue in here. Give you another option about how you want to apply your tips. I'm actually probably going to go ahead and keep this in my purse because a lot of times when I'm out and about, sometimes I'll have a nail pop off here and there. It's always nice to have some nail glue with you. So I'll probably end up keeping this in my purse because I like the applicator here. So yeah, I'm happy to have this. Yay, I got one of his brushes. I actually was really excited to try to get one of these brushes. Um, and I hope that I get more of them because I like the idea of it um, being where you can clean your nails like this. But then this right here is the part that I was really excited about. So you can get underneath the nails and really get inside um, those crevices and such. So I'm actually really excited to have this brush. Um, if I get more of them, I'm definitely going to keep one at my sink. I'm going to keep one here in the nail room, obviously. But yeah, these are some nice quality brush. I'm happy to have this. Okay, I did get some more of these kind of matte glitters and with these matte glitters um it just has like um i did get some more of these matte glitters and these just have like different size shapes of them they got the large chunky glitters the fine glitters the medium glitters all the in between so definitely have to have this oh wow you guys look at these looks like he included some acrylic brushes what oh these are absolutely gorgeous wow look at this you guys look how pretty these are let's just take a moment for the packaging on these wow these are so pretty to look at oh my gosh so i got another uh, like a number 16 acrylic brush wow and you guys i am getting more and more into my acrylic application so i'm excited to have this i want to see how big this is I wonder is it a true Kalinske brush because it looks like it's not but if nothing else it's going to be good to be able to do some swatches with but I don't know if this is true Kalinske or not you guys it looks a bit shiny to be Kalinske but like I said I'm excited to have it to be able to do some practice nails with that's a pretty big brush I'm, this is probably the biggest size acrylic brush I have because I think I only have up to a size 12 right now so I'm definitely excited to have these. He included four of them. That is really cool. Awesome. So I got me some acrylic brushes, you guys. That's cool. And to go along with the acrylic, I do have here some acrylic. Looks like this is Grand Champion. I don't know what color Grand Champion is, but the packaging on here is really, the packaging on here is really cute. It's 120 grams. It's called the powders. Okay. And yeah, let's pop it up and see what it looks like here. Oh, cool. It looks like it's a white. Oh, very nice. Very nice. Oh, I like this. It's good packaging. Yeah, it's nice and finely milled. Okay. I'll be excited to do some swatches with this, you guys. That's awesome. So, we got this. Very nice. Yeah, it's a nice seal on here, too. I like this, I like this packaging, actually. So we also got an easy ombre powder that's pretty cool it's an acrylic system here i like this packaging as well this is really nice i wonder if this is his new packaging looks like really nice and high quality there um let's just pop it open and see easy ombre powder i feel like this might be a clear acrylic okay Oh yeah, still nice, finely milled. I think this might be a clear acrylic. You know how you guys can do ombres where you do the ombre and then you pour the powder on top then you tap it off and then cure it? That's supposed to help it be more of a seamless ombre. I think that's probably what this powder is intended for. So definitely happy to have this. And this packaging is everything. I like that, that's real cute. Oh cool, look you guys. I got me an ombre brush. This is called the Puffy, I guess, met by Max Estrada. This is really cool to have. I actually recently just got one of these off of Shein. 
because I was neat. I'm y'all y'all have seen in my videos. I'm trying to learn how to do ombres. So I'm not that great at it, but happy to have this to be able to play around with. I don't think I've seen anybody haul this one just yet, so this is really really nice. Happy to have this. Ooh, you guys! I'm seeing some cool products in here. All right, so I got this little thing here that came all together inside of here. So let me just move this over to the side. Okay, so I do see here that I got a pair of nippers. Okay. They look a little dirty, so I'm going to have to wipe these down. But, um, yeah, I got here some pink nippers, which is awesome to have because this is great for removing, like, rhinestones and such from your nails. So, definitely good, happy to have these, like, nail tools. So, got this. Cool. I got some more nail tools, you guys. So, these are some silicone pushers. I actually don't have any like this. Um, this is good, I think, for um, uh, applying foils. So, it's great that he included this because we definitely need a way to apply these foils and apply them seamlessly. These look like they are of a little bit higher quality than the, the ones that I currently have. I have a few, but they're not, like, all that great. Take a look here. Oh, yeah. These are, like, much better quality than the ones I have. But this is going to be great for just when you lay the foil down and just rubbing that foil into the nail, you know? Man, that's really awesome. And uh, let me know if you guys want to see, like, a detailed review or detailed tutorial on how to apply your nail foils. Um, I got a couple of foil reviews on my channel. Um, I think I've done a foil kit review for Beatles. I've done a, a foil kit review for um, the McCart foil glue. Um, and then I also have a couple of other foil glues. I have the Star foil glue. I have Young Nails foil glue. And I also have... Um, I have one other one I can't remember it right now but I have a couple of different uh, foil glues I wanted to try to uh, test out so um, if I don't end up getting one from Enel Couture I'll just test it out with another one of my foil glues but happy to have these tools to kind of assist with that and um, yeah if y'all want to know how to apply foils you can check out some of my older videos and I'll make an updated one here coming soon so yeah happy to have these these are really nice next here we got an ink pen y'all okay you can never have too many pens something nice and cute to write with I'm gonna go ahead and pop this in my little. Um, I'm gonna pop this in my, my desk right now, so I can make sure I have me a nice pen handy and available. So next here we did get a sticker book. Okay, so this is gonna be great to put all of these stickers in um, that he's been including in these scoops. Now um, it's cool that it's nice and pink. I'm curious about how many it can hold. It looks like it can hold quite a few, which is awesome. So. I'm, I'm happy to have this. It's, this is actually how I store all of my nail stickers. Um, I do have some organization videos that show you guys how I organize my nail stickers. But these are a couple of my nail sticker books. And it just it's just books and books full of different stickers. And it just makes it easier when you're sitting down to do your nail art to just be able to flip through really quick and see everything you have at a glance. It makes you more likely to use it. Um, so yeah, like I said, I have tons and tons of stickers, tons and tons of stickers. I try to organize them by, um, um, like, so I think this one's my floral book because I got a lot of floral stickers in here, but flowers, uh, butterflies, I try to organize them also by season. So I think in here, oh wait, oh no, these are just some random, oh these are just some of the cool bigger stickers I have. Oh, yeah, I forgot about these. See, look, this is why it's good to have them out so you can easily get to them. Um, but I think in this one here, this is like my holiday themed one. Yeah, so I got Christmas stickers in here. I have, um, I think I got some Halloween stickers in here. I think I got a little bit of Easter in here. Um, so yeah, it's cool to have your stickers organized this way. It just like, again, it just makes it easier to get to everything. So I think it's great that he included this in here because it, it, it just makes life easier when you have all your stickers in one place. So I got that. Wow, you guys, look at this. Okay, got a dapping dish. Okay, I've been seeing everybody with their little dapping dishes, so I'm excited to have one too. How cute is this, y'all? It's pink. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love it. That is cute. That's a cute little dapping dish here. I actually have one like this that I uh, hauled from um, Dollar Tree. It looks almost identical to this, but this one, I believe. Is a little bit smaller so I'll be happy to have this I actually am going to keep this out at my nail desk here um, and I'll have it for monomer I like that it comes with these little grooves on the side uh, because you'll be able to set your brush on top of it I have another dappin dish oh this one right here so this is the dappin dish that I currently use and I really love it because it's a crown and I can just set my brush on it in between using it right so it's nice to be able to have this right here 
to be able to now um, it'll hold your brush as you're doing your acrylic nails. So I'm happy to have this. That's really, really nice. But I guess it'll be more fitting to put Max's brush on here, huh? Look at that. Pink galore. Okay, let's go. Pink is in the building. Okay, y'all. So yeah, that's really cute. Y'all got y'all little brush. Dip it in there, do your nails, set it down. Oh, I love it. This is really nice. I'm very, very happy to have this. That's nice. So I do see here that he also included some Enel Couture Maxi Wet Wipes. And it says it's a multiple use moist cleaning wipe for hands. I'm sorry, for nails and makeup remover. Oh, okay. Nails and makeup. So these are makeup wipes. And it says it's 120 pieces high capacity. So that's pretty cool. So are these makeup wipes? That's pretty cool. Makeup remover wipes, oil for your hands. All right, I'm down for it. I'm down for it. I'll, I'll get some use out of this for sure. I'll keep this here in the nail room. He also included these here, which is nail care brush wipes. Um, and it's 60 pieces. It looks like they're pretty big. I want to see what these look like. I've seen a few people haul them, but not anybody open them. So let's open them up and see what they are talking about. Okay. Just take one out here. Oh wow. Oh, this is nice. Wow. All right, you guys, this feels like the quality of those Lux wipes, but bigger footprint. And I like the fact that it's white because it's not gonna bleed out. One of the things that I wasn't the biggest fan of with those Lux wipes is that they're pink and when you put acetone on them, they bleed out. You won't have that problem with these. These are, these are nice. These are nice nail care brush wipes. I like this. And actually in this package, he did include another uh, Lux wipe in here, which is awesome. It's 50 of them that come in here. Y'all, let's do a quick comparison video because these are these are nice. See, yeah, this is kind of similar to the one that I just pulled out. Look at that. Actually, this one's even softer. That's impressive. Wow. So yeah, these are really good quality nail wipes as well um they're really soft to the touch but these are even softer i didn't even think that was possible that's pretty cool i actually really like these a lot i think i'm gonna like these and get more use out of these than i would these because again with these you actually have to like when you put acetone on them the color dissipates and in case you guys are curious about what i'm talking about let me go ahead and just cut this one in half now and just kind of show you guys what i'm talking about um so if you put acetone on this wipe right if you put acetone on here you see how the color just like it it, it moves it evaporates and so then it ends up being like a white wipe um and one of the things i don't like about that is the fact that it um it has bled onto some of my nail designs before so yeah not the biggest biggest fan of deluxe wipes i will use them though because um i've just been using them to wipe off my acrylic brushes with when i'm doing acrylics but um very cool that he included these i am in love with these these are really really nice it's almost like a towel that's cool all right max come through with the nice high quality products okay okay so it's that and then we got the Lux wipes he did also include a monomer which is always great i'm gonna see here which one i got It'd be nice if I got the cotton candy monomer. Oh my gosh. I've been hearing good things about that. <laughs> okay, so it's the magic, it's the pink magic monomer. Now this one, y'all, it looks like a lot of this is evaporated. It's more than a fourth of the bottle gone. It comes, the bottle starts at about right here, you guys. Well, it's a lot missing, but um, nonetheless, cool to have this monomer. One of the things I like about this particular container is that it has this snap lid. I don't know if you guys have opened up your monomer yet. But I just think it's cool that it has this little snap lid that you can pop open, right? Pop close and um, just be able to make sure there's no spillage with your monomer. I think that's awesome. So very cool design on this. And um, again, in case you guys have missed it, I have swatched um, products with his um, monomer. I'll leave that particular scoop unboxing um, down in the description box below so you guys can see how this works. But this is fast setting monomer, okay? Um, so you, if you're new to doing nails, I wouldn't um, use this as a beginner. Um, this is something I'd probably end up using to apply my press ons with acrylic or do 3d nail art with um do some uh, 3d do some 3d nail art on the nails or even put in silicone modes like do some acrylic um 3d charms and such so yeah cool to have this there's a time and place for fast there is a time and place for fast setting monomers so happy to have this oh wow you guys look at this he included a whole armrest up in here 
Stop playing with me, y'all. Oh my gosh. This is really dope. Oh my goodness. I am in love with this. Look at this, y'all. What? Now he included a whole armrest in the super scoop. Let's go. Now it does sit up really, really high. But this, honestly, this would be cool for when you're doing your nails and filming. Look at that. I like how high it sits up because, yeah, you guys can see the detail of the nail art a lot easier. It's a little closer to the face. I love this, okay? And I might actually include this in my travel nail kit, you guys. So, that's it. I just recently did a video where I organized my travel nail kit. And this here is the current armrest I have in it. Let me see if I can zoom out. This here is the current armrest that I have in it. Just a little pink plastic thingy I got from Shein. And actually, these are the nails I'm going to be doing on my next client. So exciting, you guys. So exciting. But I'm going to see if this actually fits in here. So I'm going to fold this down. Oh, and it does. All right, y'all. I think this is going to be what I put in my nail kit. Okay, Max. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Y'all like that. Alrighty, so yeah, this armrest is a great, great, great item to have added into the scoops. I love it. Okay, you guys, another way too I just thought about you can use this is if you're filming. Um, so because it's so long, you can actually rest your actual arm on it, right? So I might actually end up using this to film videos like this. Kind of have it off to the side. I'm going to just rest my whole arm on here while I paint my nails for you guys. What do y'all think about that? I like that too. That's another way that you can use this if you're not um, using it to use on clients. And another reason why it's so tall too is so that you can fit a nail lamp underneath it. You see how tall it is? This just to give you guys some reference of how tall it is. Let's see. Yeah, it's pretty tall, right? So you can fit a whole nail lamp underneath here. This is such a cool addition. I don't know. I'm like really impressed with this. Thanks, Max. I think this is really cool. Really nice, high quality, nice cushion here giving Lux vibes you know I like it I like it a lot this also be a way to like display your nails when they're done like it's cute y'all it's cute it's cute it's cute okay I'm very happy about that but like I said I'll probably end up if I don't put it in my travel nail kit I'll probably just use it to like paint my nails you guys what do you think what do you think okay anywho <laughs> I'm done and it folds up, which makes it nice and portable. This is a great addition to a super scoop. Awesome, that's cool. Now, we're getting down to the wire, y'all. This has been an awesome scoop so far. So, this here, um, let's take a look-see. Yay! Okay, so this is the finger nail lamp. So, is this is like the single flash cure lamp for when you're doing like gel -X nails and stuff like that. I've seen a couple people get this one, and it is so cute. Look how tiny it is, wow. It is itty bitty, you guys. Look at that. So it has two LED lights in here. Okay. Really simple design to it. Um, let me see if I can get it plugged in real quick. It does come with a little cord here. I'm going to go ahead and plug it in really quick and see how it works. And let's turn it on. Okay, cool. It works. So it's just a mini flash cure light here. Huh? I can feel the heat coming from the light, but yeah, it's kind of like for the purpose of doing gel X nails, you put your nail on and then you just put it underneath here to cure. So that's really cute. It's nice to include one of these in there. And let me see how many watts this is. Looks like this is three and a half watts and 30 second timer. Okay, cool. So it has a 30 second timer on here and a 60 second timer on here. So that's cool. If you press it, if you press and hold it down twice, it turns on for 60 seconds. If you press and hold it on, it's 30 seconds. That's pretty cool. I like this. It's cute. I like how small and compact this is. I'll probably end up putting this in my nail kit as well. I like the portability of it and how tiny it is. Very cool. All right, so I got this. All right, you guys, I'm super excited. I finally got me some Happy Gel. So I do have Happy Gel and some of my other scoops, but they like the really t small 15 ml bottles. This is 60 grams, you guys. So two whole ounces of some poly gel. And this one is in the Grand Champion White. So this is gonna be really cute. So you all um, know that we got a lot of these, um, like those glitter nail tips in um, some of the kits. I'm gonna be applying some of those using this poly gel. It gives it a really cute white base and then it's gonna look like it has like the glitter on top. Um, I'm gonna do a whole tutorial dedicated to showing you guys how to use this with those full cover nail tips that were included in our boxes. But I'm happy to have this. Apparently his poly gel is 
really good. It's like 60% acrylic. Um, so it's nice and stiff, which is the type of poly gel that I like to use. Um, so I'm going to be excited to put this to use. I'm not going to open it now because I'm going to do a whole dedicated video showing you guys how to use this to apply his one, two, three go tips. But I'm very happy to have me some happy gel. Okay. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, cool. All right. So now I'm getting to some gel polishes here. Okay. So it looks like we got here a couple of different gel polishes. So it looks like I got four of the precious minerals. No, five. Okay. Five precious minerals and then two of the regular gel polishes. And this is awesome, you guys. I don't think any of these are colors that I already have. That's pretty cool. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and put this to the side and show you guys each of these colors individually. So we got this first color here and that's in 0, 0, 035. Ooh, that's pretty. So this is like a really deep, um, kind of a really deep well this is a kind of a grayish glitter purple color has some grayish undertones to it really beautiful glitter next we have a 104 oh this is gorgeous oh this is nice this is like a jelly black with glitter in it oh I love it I'm a big fan of like jelly colors these days, you guys. Um, I've been, at first I used to like colors that were always like super opaque, but I'm really starting to appreciate jelly colors and the versatility of them to be able to build up the opacity. Oh, this is really cute. I like this a lot. Really beautiful hollow glitter. This would be cute for some black glitter ombre nails. Ooh, definitely happy to have this. Super cute. I love it. Love it, love it. That's nice. The next one here is from the Precious Minerals collection. I actually think this is my favorite collection from Enel Couture, Precious Minerals. I just think I like the thickness of the gels and I like the packaging as well. Easy to store. Okay, so the first color we have here is 168. Ooh, this is cute. It's a really cute uh, pink color here. It's like a deep pink. That's nice. We also have 158. Ooh, baby, these are on here, ain't they? Okay. And this is a really pretty glitter color. I actually think I have this color already, but it came um, in a bottle that had like a different color lid to it. So, um, yeah, I think I have this already. Really, really pretty. Nice gold glitter. Next, I have 111. Ooh, oh wow, look at that. Do y'all see this? Oh, this is gorgeous. So this is a black glitter that has a ton of itty bitty tiny hollow glitters in it. Oh, this is gorgeous, wow. This is giving galaxy vibes for sure. Oh my God, this is so pretty. This is so pretty, I love it. Yeah, that's gorgeous, wow. That's a nice color to have. Next here we have 208, okay. Ooh, baby, these bad boys seal shut, okay. So if you all are ever having issues with opening up your bottles, okay, um, one thing you can do is just put a rubber band on it, wrap it around a couple times, and then it'll open up. Well, it used to. I don't think my rubber band big enough. Let me do this one. Okay, so yeah, just take a rubber band and wrap it around a couple times. And that gives it a little bit of a grip and then it, it opens right on up. So in case y'all don't know that, that's a little hack for you. <laughs> that's what I do when I have issues opening up my polishes. But yeah, let's take a look at this one. Looks like it's gonna be really pretty. Ooh, this is cute, you guys. So this is a glitter that has um, little chunks of white and chunks of pink in it oh my gosh if this wouldn't be perfect for valentine's day i don't know what would it's gorgeous and then it has like gold fine glitters inside of like a transparent or clear gel that is so pretty i don't have anything like this in my collection y'all i'm loving it i'm absolutely loving it okay yes and then we also have here it looks like 173 
And I believe this might be a pearly white color. Let's take a look here. Ooh, and it is. How gorgeous. Y'all, this is really pretty. Oh my gosh. This is gorgeous. I'm so excited with these colors I got, y'all. This is awesome. This is really awesome. Loving the versatility. I'm loving the variety that's included in these in these boxes these days. This is just so cool and so awesome. So, yeah, like I said, it came with five precious minerals. So that's five, six, seven. So seven gel polishes and my super scoop. And I also have two more polishes to show you guys, which is really cool. The gel liners. Okay, so let me go ahead and show you guys those. So it did come with two gel liners as well. Again, y'all, this it's the it's the variety for me, okay? And the fact that there's a yellow in here, he must know that that's my favorite color, cause yeah. So I'm happy to have these. So we got a yellow and we got um, a purple. So let's take a closer look. And I'm I'm really really excited to have some of his gel liners. I love working with gel liners. It just makes nail art nice and easy. You don't have to use a lot of different tools. And so I'm excited to see what this consistency is talking about, okay? So this here is the yellow. Oh, I was mistaken, y'all. It's a gold. Ooh, wee. If this don't look like a million dollars, I don't know what does. How? Oh my gosh. Y'all see this? Wow. That's a beautiful gold. Oh my goodness. That's really nice. Okay. Well, that's to my surprise. That is a gorgeous gold. And it is so thick, y'all. When I say it is thick, thick. Y'all see, it is not moving at all off of that brush. I like that. I absolutely love working with thick gels. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, y'all. This is nice. This is really nice. Holy moly. And it says that it is super rich one coat gel. It looks like it's going to be. And it's 8 ml. I'm happy to have a gold. Gold is definitely a staple. You'll get plenty of use out of it. And then next here we have a neon gel liner in one I mean zero one one. So it looks like it's gonna be a really nice purple color here. Let's see. Oh wow! Oh that's pretty, and it's rich and smooth and creamy. Oh my gosh! Like I am in love, y'all. I'm just excited to have more of his gel products. That is awesome. Hey, these liners look like they legit though, y'all. Oh, I'm excited. I'm definitely going to be doing a follow-up video swatching these products for you guys because these look amazing. And then I got here another Maxi Ink. And I think I might have gotten this color in my last one, but these are just his uh, marble inks. Oh, actually, no, I don't think I did. This is black. Oh, cool. Now that I got black. Okay, y'all, look. Hey, I got set up with this one now. Okay. I'm going to just take this box that the little Dappin Dish came in, show you guys what color this is. I think it's black. Oh, my gosh it is black y'all what I think the last one I got was purple oh that's awesome that is awesome okay cool I'm so glad I have a black marble ink oh my gosh y'all this is so cool I am in love with this super scoop so yeah I got this and then we got two more items you guys so the next item we have here is a flashy cure lamp OMG okay he just came hard with the super scoop okay now we got two nail lamps and a nail rest okay I'm just like it's a while for me but it's a flashy cure lamp and so this is a, a gooseneck lamp you guys like wow that's so cool Look at that. Oh my, this is so cool. This is so cool. I love it. And it does come with um, a C port charger here. And then it comes with the instructions. I'm curious to see how many watts it is. Wow, you guys, you get a whole gooseneck lamp in this super scoop. That is crazy. I think this is really awesome. It makes sense to kind of include these because he gives you all these different options because he includes all those cool tips in it. And this is really nice and sturdy too. I like that it's like a sturdy lamp, it has a strong solid base to it. I have a few gooseneck lamps but it must fall right over. This one has a strong base to it. it, has his logo here on the back. This is the charging port here. And I thought it was cordless and rechargeable, but it's not. So you'll just have to plug it in. You just gotta plug it in and look at that y'all. Six LED lights. It's really nice. So this is nice and handy to have when you want to flash cure your nails. Uh, let me turn it around this way so you can kind of see it better. There we go. So this is nice and handy to have when you want to flash cure your nails. You know, you put your full cover tips on, put it underneath here, and then boom, it flash cures it really quick. I mean, 
This is nice, handy to have for sure. Yeah, I like this. This is really cool. If you get, if you guys are somebody who does gel X nails or do nail art and things like this, it's just handy to have one of these. You can place your nail here. If you need to cure, put your full cover tips on. I love gooseneck lamps like this. I do wish, but I do have some that's cordless and rechargeable, so I'll probably get more use out of those, but definitely handy to have this um, as a backup lamp. So this is awesome. And then the last item we got here in the box, you guys, is this here. Let's take a look and see what this is. Oh, okay. These are those tumblers I've been seeing everybody with. So this here is a tumbler. Okay, and uh, it comes with a straw, and it has this. Oh, that's cute. Kind of like a little snow globe situation here. That's cute. Oh, that's cute. I kind of I like it though. I didn't think I was actually gonna like it because when I saw everybody else's with theirs, I'm like, what is this? It looks a little kitty. Um, still looks kitty, but it's actually cute. Um, I like that I got a pink one. I like that I got a pink one instead of a purple one. It kind of matches the decor in my room. Um, so who knows? I might end up using it, y'all. This mug <laughs> is big, though. Um, it's cute, though. Actually, I didn't think I was going to like it that much, but it's, it's pretty cute, actually. So, yeah, it has a little, the little glitters here at the top. What does it say here? It's cute. Yeah, I like it. You put the little straw right here. I might end up using this thing in my nail room. That's so funny. I didn't think I was going to like it or use it, but I think I might actually. I think I would like it more if it didn't have these little styrofoam pieces in here. Um, but it ain't too bad. But if nothing else, I can always give it to my daughter to use. But actually, I don't mind it here. I, don't, I actually don't mind how it looks. That's so funny. I didn't think I was going to like it um, from how I saw it online, but I actually like it more in person. So that's interesting. Yeah, y'all. I might end up using this here in the nail room. That is so funny. It's cute. It's cute. Okay, so yeah, y'all, that is everything, all right? That is everything that was included here in my mystery box. It is all empty now. All right, you guys, this is everything that was included in the Super Scoop. I must say, I am very, very impressed with everything that was in this box. You guys, all these items was only 60 bucks, and he had a 35% off discount code on top of that. This stuff is a steal. Oh my gosh. And his products are a really good, high quality too. I'm just... I'm enamored at everything that's included here. So again, y'all, this is my super scoop. I only got one super scoop and all this stuff was included in here. So you get an armrest, you get a gooseneck lamp, you get a mini flash cure lamp, you get acrylic powder, ombre powder, um, tons of nail art tools, gel polishes, poly gels, um, dapping dish, stickers. You even get a, a drinking cup, like what? Lux wipes, uh, photo sticker books, gel liners, you guys. Like, it's the variety for me. You get wet wipes. I just, ombre tools, uh, your foils. You just, you get a little bit of everything. And so I think this box was well worth it and some. Um, I love the variety of items that was included. I cannot wait to put all of these to use. Again, you guys, if you've missed any of my previous scoop unboxings, I have a whole dedicated playlist to it. I'm going to leave it linked down in the description box below. I'm going to do some more swatch videos um, so that um, y'all can see what all these colors and acrylics and even the poly gel looks like swatched out. Um, and, then, and then I can also put these acrylic brushes to use. He included acrylic brushes, you guys. Oh my gosh. Like... This is so cool. And then even the nail tips that were included, they're different. They're sculpted nail tips. They're clear and they are active length nail tips. So it's nice that he's including a variety of different nail tips in these boxes and these scoops. And just, I'm really happy, y'all. As y'all can tell, I'm really, really happy. And do I have more scoops on the way? I say yay. Okay, <laughs> I'm just playing. I think I might. Okay, so stay tuned to the channel. Um, y'all, I did. I ordered a, I, I ordered a color scoop. I did. I couldn't help myself. So I went back on, got a color scoop. So that's going to be coming soon because I'm just excited about trying out more of his gel products. So I can't wait until that package comes in the mail. Um, this one did take a little bit to get here. I think it took two weeks for it to even ship out. Um, and then after that, once it shipped, I got it in a couple of days. So you guys be patient with your orders. If they haven't shipped just yet, I guess he had like a lot of sales that happened during that Lunar New Year sale. But 
Yeah, y'all, I'm really, really happy. I can't wait to put these products to use. So stay tuned to the channel. I'll be doing follow-up videos, swatching out all these products, like I said. And I'm going to show you guys a lot of cool and interesting ways to use these products. I mean, it's just so much you can do with this stuff. And, I mean, it's, it's nail products for days. I love it. Um, so, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Have you gotten your super scoop yet? And what did you guys think about it? I thought it was pretty epic, if I'm being honest with you, to get these nail lamps and an armrest. I mean, honestly, a couple of these items alone is like 40 50 dollars so to get that plus all of this other stuff this is a steal of the century like really though absolutely love it i'm excited for my next scoop to get here and i'll definitely be doing an unboxing with you guys as i have been doing and let me know your thoughts do you guys like it did you like what you got did you get something different did you get something similar let me know your thoughts and like i said i did actually use some of his nail stickers that i got in a previous scoop to do this nail set i just did a simple white nail set with some abstract nail art on it thought it was really cute i'll have a tutorial of that coming soon you guys um but yeah i do upload every tuesday thursday and saturday if you all like what you saw here definitely stick around join the happy family i'd love to have you and as always you guys leave some love in the comments down below and i'll see you in my next video i hope you all have a wonderful awesome spectacular day Bye!